You know, I didn't start out with my um, college education thinking I would end up in aviation. Um, my grandmothers both had 30 year long careers with aviation. I loved watching what they had to do and going to the air shows with them and coming on site on their, you know, their family days. But never in my life did I think I would end up in aviation. It's so fun to be on site and hear the startup of the engines. It really brings you and connects you to the aircraft. And I'm not an engineer. I'm not a technician touching the aircraft every day, but being on site and seeing them around you just makes you feel grounded to what you're doing every day and how you support that. So I jumped in um, starting with Bombardier in 2008 and really had not had a professional career before that. Um, Bombardier and Learjet were a well-known company in, in Wichita and that's what I was looking for, just, just starting with a, a strong company where I had potential to grow. I came in as an hourly employee supporting the engineering team doing data control. That, after a few months, turned into a more permanent position doing continuous improvement projects and supporting our Achieving Excellence system. After um, about a year doing that, I started helping on the development program for the Learjet 75 project and then moved over to sales and I did sales support. 2017, I moved over to support the Bass Network, more continuous improvement projects and really anything they threw at me. If uh, they needed help on a certain project, I would kind of help gather everyone together and put a plan in place and move on from there and then give it back to the, the technical experts. The mentors I've had through the years were instrumental to, to getting me to where I am today and keeping me here for 15 years. Um, I would say I'm always, always trying to teach our, our interns and our, our younger um, employees, our newer employees, is just to, to put yourself out there. You see something that's out there in an available position or um, something you find interesting, go talk to somebody about it. If you don't have a mentor, ask, ask somebody in the leadership team like, hey, I'd really like to learn more about this, tell me more. Um, and I'm always trying to encourage our interns to, to do the same and our young employees. I think our products are just, they're top of the line. Just soaking that in, it just, it's a sense of pride for me. You know, if this isn't an eight to five job, I don't think for anybody, we live it. And I think our customers feel that at the end of the day.